I have a really quick beauty tip. I'm on a little bit of a hair kick right now, so I figured my last video was mentioning um, how to do your hair up, but one thing that I wanted to just expand on in its own video, which is such an important thing that's often overlooked, is how to lock a bobby pin. A lot of times, um, if you've ever had your hair done professionally or you do it yourself, you just have like a little mountain of bobby pins in the back of your hair and pieces still fall out. So you actually can get your entire hair up with one bobby pin and I'm going to show you how. Real quick tip, instead of taking the bobby pin and just slipping it into the hair and taking another one and crossing it over and then maybe a third one and locking it down. You, you, all you're doing is you're piling them on top of the, uh, each other. The ridge on the top of the bobby pin is actually supposed to act like a corkscrew to grip the hair. So I'm going to turn around so you can see this. What you want to do is you want to take the ridge side down, okay? Don't open it. I'm going to stop right there and say this. When you open the bobby pin, you're actually expanding the, um, the tension, and you don't want to do that. You want it to be able to stay tight and locked. If you open it up, you're just there really is no purpose. So if you ever see anyone doing that, or if you're catching yourself doing it, just know that 800 other bobby pins will probably have to follow because that wasn't the right way to get in to begin with. Here we go. Also another thing, don't ever put them in your mouth like I just did. <laughs> Take the bobby pin, weave, grab the hair that you want, seesaw it the other way, and then lock it down into place. You're going to take it, just give it a little weave, grab it on the amount of hair that you want. So now I'm grabbing the loop and then turn it the other way and slide it down. Okay, now I had no mirror. I know I'm not getting points for neatness, but the idea is still there. What you want to do, and I'm going to take this down. And that's on. I mean, with just one bobby pin in the hair, I feel like I have this thing. You know what I mean? You want to take the bobby pin, just kind of give it a quick little circle so that it's already like entangled in hair. Lift it up, hook it around all of the hair that you're looking to pin. Again, don't try to overwork the bobby pin. Get it right where you need it and then seesaw it the opposite way and slide it down so whoop. and there you go I hope this was super helpful very easy and very useful so that if you are caught without an elastic band or a clip and you're like sweating and you really just want to get your hair off your neck um, think about this tip and hopefully this will come in very handy for you I uh, thank you for watching. Again, I love your comments, so keep them coming. If you aren't already a subscriber, definitely subscribe in the corner. And I look forward to seeing you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.